So i kind of been thinking a lot lately um, about the actual channel and how things have actually been going with it. Now, you know, since 2016 or prior to that even, uh, maybe 2014, oh, fuck, that's been a long time. I've been doing this. I've been making content off and on for a few years. Uh, not really a lot of uh, movement, but we are over 400 followers, and that's amazing. And that's great on Twitch as well as, you know, YouTube, TikTok, you name it. We have, I mean, I think we have a pretty nice audience. Um, lately, I've noticed some of the videos that I've been posting usually getting almost under 10 views per video. <clears throat> and, you know, that could be where I've done a ra radical change in the content. I know some videos, more spicy videos, get more views than some of the other stuff. But usually, on average, just until recently, we'd usually get anywhere between, you know, 15 to 50 views per video, which, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to complain about it because, you know, it's great if just one person was to watch. But one thing I've been kind of worried about lately, and I know it has a lot to do with me, uh, I've been busy a lot lately um, with job stuff and uh, working on all kinds of other stuff. And, you know, I don't put a whole lot of content out. And the stuff I have been putting out has been a little um, little spicy compared to what I usually do. And I wanted to try to be more open and honest with you guys. Instead of being the fake YouTuber that everybody seems to be. Because you have a lot of fakeness within YouTube. And if you go back on some of my previous videos, you'd kind of see that. I, you know, I personify that everything is just okay. Everything's peachy. Everything's great. Sometimes you have to be honest. You just have to be honest. You have to kind of clear everything up and just be yourself. And that's something I've been trying to do. I've been trying to actually be myself. Now, you know, that might turn some people off. I have noticed, you know, some people just fell off. And, you know, I, I apologize. My, my goal is not to offend you. My goal is to maybe let you see another side of things that you normally... Because you don't see a lot of it. Because a lot, a lot of stuff on the internet, um, especially social media, is usually pretty high left-leaning fake stuff. And... You know, there are some channels like Geeks and Gamers, RJ, not RJ, RK, shit, who is that? Okay, I'm sorry, guys. Yellow Flash 2, and I can't think of the other guy's name. I RK Outpost. Those guys, those guys. And the quartering. Um, I've been kind of going through this. I, I, I listen to these guys all the time. Uh, I listen to people like Joe Rogan, Jordan Peterson. Um, you know, a long time ago, I used to be heavily super liberal. And I'm not saying I'm super conservative, because I'm not. Um, I'm right in the middle, right in the middle. I listen to what people say are super right-leaning uh, commentators like Tim Pool, um, <laughs> some other ones. And you know, always think it's funny whenever they're like, Oh, you're the super right, right, right conservative racist, because you only like Republicans. I don't like Republicans. I don't like Democrats. I don't. I don't care for it. I don't care for it. I'll tell you. I'll tell you who I'm voting for. But I had problems. I had problems with the way I was opening myself up. You know, I, I wanted to be likable. And I would be fake. Fake likable, if that makes sense. You know, I'm not the best at getting my words out, and I know that. And I'm not the most interesting person in the world. But I try to be real. I've been trying to be real lately. Um, you know, since the beginning of the year, we've had several videos that's, you know, different than anything I've ever put out. Um, same type of format. You just see my ugly face. We've been doing things like video game reviews and stuff like that, which the video game reviews don't get very many views uh, for some reason. You know, we just released um, Pokemon Arceus, which was amazing. Um, you know, I played shit out of that. I, I love playing video games, and, you know, I like to share that with you guys. 
and you know i'd like to get to streaming again eventually because i you know last year i was like oh, i'm going to stream again and i never did because i was fucking lazy honestly uh lazy and dealing with my mental ineptitude um which is kind of crazy uh, so i guess ultimately the video is just me ranting like i always rant I do like to hear you guys' opinion on things, what you would rather hear. I, I got asked on TikTok. I posted a video on TikTok the other day, and it was basically asking the same kind of question. I said, hey, I've been doing this since 2016 or 2014. I don't know what year. It's been a long time. Should I give up? And so I mentioned, hey, why don't you try doing a podcast? Which, you know, we had a podcast there for a while. Um, this was a few years back, maybe 2018, 2019. We had the Bits and Pieces Smash Cast. Which, you know, it was fun. It was fun. We had a few of my friends. We, we got together and we just jacked off and talked about video games and movies and nerdy shit. But I think, I think what he was getting at is, you know, some of my videos can be long-winded. Especially for just a video that's supposed to be 10 minutes long. Maybe having longer videos is a good thing, but turn that into a podcast rather than that. That and also possibly changing the name. Maybe starting a second channel. Um, Bits and Pieces has been around for a long time. Bits and Pieces has. It's It's been, been around a long time. Um... It's been fun. It's been fun. I've been thinking a whole lot lately. Maybe I should start a second channel. Start all over. Start over from scratch. At least with YouTube. And just see how it goes. Instead of, you know, focusing... You, you can still keep this channel running, obviously. Still talking about video game stuff. But kind of put the more spicy stuff on that channel. Um... Just to differentiate things, and I don't want to make it complicated. You know, the Bits and Pieces channel can still be used for video games as well as unboxings and stuff like that. But I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't really. What, what do you guys think, honestly? You know, for the three people that's watching that watches this, what do you guys think? Do you think we should start a new channel, start from scratch? It's just brand new. You know, I turned 35 this year, and I've been doing this since either 2014 or 2016. I don't fucking know. <laughs> it's been a while. We're at 778 videos. It's, it's a lot. It's a lot for a channel this, uh, this small, honestly. It's quite a bit. You know, we don't upload stuff every single day as much as I would love to. That would be good. Maybe that is something we can possibly do. Maybe three times a week. Uh, take a look at some articles and some things that you know I think is kind of fucked up and talk about it. Maybe that's something we should do. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong. It'd be kind of cool to eventually get to the point where maybe uh, I can join people like Geeks and Gamers and uh, Neurotic. Um, God, that would be amazing to, to actually sit on a uh, stream with those guys um you know i i started i've been following geeks and gamers for a long time i actually started listening to nerd Rotic and rk outpost and yellow flash uh probably back in shit i want to say june of last year give or take and i really enjoy their content i really do um that's kind of how i want to approach things honestly i think that's um they don't bullshit around, and I don't want to bullshit around anymore. I, I want to be honest and stuff like that. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Definitely want to know your opinion. Uh, should we start a new channel? What should we do, honestly? And if you haven't already, feel free to hit that follow button, hit that subscribe button. Uh, you know, if you don't want us to start a new channel, dude, we can do something different. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I definitely appreciate it, and I'll see you soon.